Hi friends, so first we need to install Samba. So you can install Samba uh, in Ubuntu using uh, apt get command. sudo apt get install Samba and Samba hyphen client. So these two packages I am going to install it. Okay, you can see that it's already installed in my system. Okay, so after that we need to make sure that um, Samba server is running. So basically we can use this command sudo systemctl status nmbd. This command will show the status of the Samba payment. So you can see it's active and running. Okay. <coughs> now Samba server is ready. Next I am going to create a folder in this uh, Linux Ubuntu system to share with uh, other system like windows and mac so i'm going to my documents folder i'm going to create a new folder um, its name is my share just give some name so this is the folder i am going to share okay so inside that folder i am going to create one sample file uh, test file test uh, uh, directory one something okay now now my folder is ready for share so what you what you have to do is just right click then select properties then go to local network share then click on share this folder here you can if you want to give some different name you can give it here then click on allow others <coughs> allow others to create and delete files in this folder then guest access then click on create share then click on add the permissions automatically okay done now we have done so just uh, we have to test it so first we need to find the IP of your Samba uh, IP of the machine where you installed this Samba server for that you can use this command ip link address you can use the command ip address so let me find the ip address this is the ip address okay so i am going to test it So we can test it with Samba client. Samba client double slash then IP address of the Samba server. Then <coughs> the name which you given here, uh, I think uh, you, you are given some name here, right? In the properties, local of share. You are given share name. So that share name you have to use it. So this is a share name. Okay, just enter. Then enter the password of the system where you install the Samba server. Okay, then now you can see the Samba CLI, the console, just type ls. You can see the test dir1 directory which you created inside this uh, my share folder. Okay, now it's ready. Our, our Samba server setup is ready in the in Ubuntu system. Next, I am going to show how we can access uh, this folder from Windows system. Okay. So, <coughs> go to your Windows system. In this PC, right click. Then select add a network location. Then click next. Then select this option, choose a custom network location, click on next. Then here you need to enter the IP address of the Samba server, then the share name. Share name is my share. Right. Then click on next. Then next. Okay, you can see a shortcut for this location will be appear appearing computer okay you can finish okay 
After that, let's uh, go to uh, this PC. So in the bottom, you can see uh, you can see the link here. Just click on that. See now it's ready. You can see test directory one here. So let me test it. Uh, let me create one more folder here in my shell. I'm going to create one more file. Uh, B1. Okay, then go to so, um, Windows system. You can see B, B1 here. Now our Samba server is uh, we have fully set up the Samba server and we have seen how we can access that uh, shared folder from Windows system. Okay, so please subscribe my channel, please like and share the videos. If you have any doubt, please comment.